Do you want to just give reactions to what's happened tonight? Yeah, absolutely delighted. Um, we came to the meeting obviously concerned at all of the um, people who were we knew were against the motion and uh, it's been almost five hours of uh, listening to people talk and questions and answers and uh, just very relieved that at the end of the day uh, the, the result was uh, in our favour. What, what does this mean for the football club do you think? Well, as we said uh, this evening that uh, we can't sustain uh, the business and the club at Griffin Park uh, in, the, in the 21st century. We need to be in a purpose-built stadium with a uh, larger capacity uh, where we can get more revenue and if we can do that we can be sustainable uh, because in the long term that has to be right for the club. Uh, have you been in touch with Matthew tonight? What, what does he think? Yes, I've been uh, been texting Matthew uh, during the evening and uh, obviously texted him the minute the result came through and uh, he's obviously very, very delighted. He knows how hard we've all worked to achieve this. None of it would have been possible without his financial support and for that we, we're all extremely grateful. Are you comfortable as the chairman, as Matthew's sort of financial advisor with, with, the, with the sums? Yes, yes, we've done a lot of work on the sums and uh, we're, we're relatively comfortable that uh, we can make this work. Uh, there has been obviously a lot of money put into the club by Matthew and he will need to put some more money in uh, to, to make this happen but overall the result we think will be uh, one that is achievable and uh, we look forward to taking us further and actually getting the stadium built. Uh, finally Cliff, Brentford have been sort of trying to move stadium well before I was born, it goes back to the 60s and the site is now the Fountain Leisure Centre. Mm. As chairman, you're the man who's finally got something to go forward, not you personally, but you're sure. your chairman when it's happened. What does that mean to you personally? Um, well, I'm, I'm obviously, uh, I feel fantastic that uh, I've been fortunate enough to be chairman when this result has come through. But I, I can't take much of the credit, frankly. Uh, the credit belongs to uh, people like Brian Burgess and Chris Gammon who have worked tirelessly for eight, nine, 10, 11 years on this project and, and the team of people that they've built around them. So they're the guys that really should take all the credit for, for what's been achieved tonight, along with Matthew, because without his financial support, uh, again, this would not, not have been possible. Uh, my, I see my, my role as, as, as the guardian for the club and to make sure that everything is done properly and uh, within, the, with, within what we can afford. Thank you very much. Okay.